Hello, and welcome to another great edition of LA Rider. I'm Sandy Michelet, and if you like motorcycles, you've come to the right place. Tonight, we kick off the fourth year of LA Rider, and we welcome all of our new friends from New Orleans. We're coming to you tonight from the Transportation Revolution, home of Triumph and Vespa of New Orleans. And tonight, we're going to kick off our show with a trip to the pit stop, where every Wednesday night is an incredible bike night. Riders start arriving as early as 5.30 on a typical Wednesday evening at McGuire's Pit Stop. They don't call this the home of the Gulf Coast's largest bike night for nothing. Within 30 minutes or so, the parking lot here at the Pit Stop and the adjacent strip mall will be teeming with bikes and riders. Bike night at the Pit Stop has become somewhat of a New Orleans motorcycle tradition, according to owner Jeff McGuire who says a normal night can mean as many as 700 motorcycles. What's the largest number of bikes you've had? Uh, ever. Ever. I'd say eight, nine hundred. Between eight and nine hundred. Yeah, and, and uh, we, uh, we have rows, everything is cordoned off, and we have people out here parking bikes so everybody can get in and get out. And uh, there's so many bikes that'll fit on a row, so uh, we get a pretty, pretty good estimate every week of what we have. It's just 7 o'clock and the parking lot is already filled. And Jeff says this is just an average crowd. Sure, there's food and drink and a number of vendors too. But it's the bikes that keep people coming. A chance to see and be seen, if you will. And there are an awful lot of interesting rides to check out from vintage Milwaukee iron to the latest customs. Tell me about your bike. Well, this is the last pan and the best pan. It's the electric pan. It's the very first electric glide. It's the first Harley Davidson with electric start. It's a one year, only Harley Davidson really, that's a one year production run. It, they only made a little over 7,000 of these bikes and coming out in the 60s, a lot of them got chopped up. And so a lot of the ones that are, that are back out on the road are people, are, are motorcycles that people resurrected. I love it. I love it. Grant Miller of Abate is a regular at the pit stop on Wednesdays. He says Jeff even let him build a shed to house his Abate boot, so he doesn't even have to take it home each week. I have all my goodies and uh, all our safety stuff. So that's the official Abate office? For the pit stop. <laughs> Grant says bike nights here are a great place to promote motorcycle safety and sound out riders on issues important to the motorcycling community. And riders come from all over. On this particular night, we met riders from as far away as Hammond, Homa, Baton Rouge, and Covington. And they have been doing it for nearly 10 years and no one seems to have grown tired of it. In fact, the crowds just keep growing. So if you're looking for a great place to go on Wednesday evening, check out Bike Night at the Pit Stop. It's a New Orleans tradition. For LA Rider, I'm TW.